Yo, what's good? It's Only Entertainment TV, and we are back with another Dead Frontier video. Now we are doing a um, we're doing another review, um, because there were two new guns, well, sort of new guns, uh, that dropped this year during the Christmas event. One of them um was the chimney sweeper, which I did a review on. I even reviewed whether or not you could loot with it because, uh, you know, a lot of people are hesitant to loot sh with shotguns. Um, and then they had Santa's little helper. Now, speaking of Santa, uh, it is Christmas right now. I am recording this Christmas night. I just ate some bomb-ass dinner. Um, and I do have family over, so you might hear them laughing and, and whatnot. So, uh, if you hear anything in the background, that is them. Um, for those of you who celebrate Christmas, Merry Christmas. If you don't celebrate, uh, Christmas, Happy Holidays. Um, I hope you enjoyed the video I put up. Um, it's Christmas now, but this will go up, uh, the 26th. Um, I hope you enjoyed the video I uploaded yesterday. Um. My friend is a little crazy. I don't know. Some people uh, thought he looked familiar. And to a couple of people that were messaging me and, and commenting, I am not on drugs. <laughs> That's just me, like, you know, how I normally am when my person, you know, my personality comes out and I get to yell. I don't get to yell that often because I do live with other people and that would be rude as fuck. Um, but yeah, so no, I'm not on drugs and, and, and I just... I thought of the whole Garland thing and the mitts and, and, and whatnot, and I was like, you know, that would be that'd be a good idea. But um, regardless, we are going to be reviewing Santa's Little Helper. I believe that there are reindeer here, five of them. Now, just a little bit of uh, information. Um, Santa's Little Helper, uh, some of the stats on it are it has fucking fast firing speed. Now, that's um, somewhere along the lines of, uh, I believe, like a Scar 9000 or uh, like an Unlimited Wraith Cannon. So very, very, very fast um, firing speed. It has 8.7 hits per second, uh, roughly. Um, and then on just base stats, it does 17.8 damage per hit. And that uh, amounts to 154.79 damage per second. Now, to put that into perspective, the Hammerhead 47 which uh, the Santa's Little Helper takes 0.55, Santa, uh, and the Hammerhead 47 takes uh, 14 millimeter. Um, that has very fast firing speed, so a little bit slower, at 6.667 uh, hits per second. It does 28.6 damage per hit, um, and it does 190.6 damage per second, just on base stats, you know, completely uh, disregarding any critical hit that you might have. Um, just like base stats, that's pretty much what it does. So we're gonna get into this. I'm going to let's just let's just use it. See how it works on on this crowd of people. Um, I do have my damage boost on, but um, it shouldn't really make a difference. I kind of I kind of went over the stats, so it's uh, you know you should be able to tell. I might go on a different account just so I could do it without the damage boost, but I'm not sure. Uh, like I said, it. Um, you know, the, the, the damage it does is, is alright. Oh, fuck me. Are there any reindeer left? Hello? Oh, fuck, there they are. I got completely got caught in that. So, as you can see, the firing speed is uh, relatively quick. It's, I don't know if it's... Uh, yeah, I don't think it's quite as quick as the Scar. Um, it might be. It might just be slightly slower. I might check on that. Um, but, so it doesn't have the knockback like the shotgun does. It just has the, um, you know, it just has the, uh, very fast firing speed. And it, you know, it comes with the advantage of taking .55, which you, I, you can fit like 800 in a stack. And, you know, it's, it's relatively cheap. And I, and, I mean, for, uh, an assault rifle... Or submachine gun, whatever kind of you know area you want to put it in. <clears throat> if I'm gonna be honest, I really don't think it's that great. Um, I mean, it's not bad. Don't get me wrong; it's definitely not bad. It's just—it's definitely not a chimney sweeper. That's all I'm saying. The chimney sweeper, uh, dare I say, changed it fucking completely revolutionized the shotgun gameplay aspect of uh of this game kind of like the uh bloody machete did to melee nobody used melee before but the bloody machete came out and uh, well some people use melee but you know in in you know the bigger picture of things it wasn't used 
as often because, you know, um, it was a lot harder to, uh, you know, kill things with the melee without getting destroyed, especially exploders. And once kind of the bloody machete dropped and then they, you know, they, they reduced the, uh, the explosion. Well, not reduced. They just got rid of it entirely. If you kill an exploder with, um, excuse me, I completely got stuck there. Um, if you kill an exploder with a melee weapon, it will not explode. Once they did that, and then they came out with the bloody machete, it was like everybody was on top of it. So, um, that completely revolutionized the fucking melee aspect of the game. And then, um, man, I should really play better. <laughs> um, and then the shotgun just absolutely fucking destroyed, uh, you know, the, the, the shotgun aspect of the game, you know, the chimney sweeper, just like, like, I use shotguns now, wasn't a shotgun player before, but I am a shotgun player now, um, just because it's good, I'm gonna die, I died, look at that, fucking died, at $391,000 on me, just died, just like that, um, if I'm gonna be honest, uh, apart from my, uh, shit gameplay, I, I just, I don't think it's that great. I really don't. Um, it's just not, hold on, I'm going to pause the video. I'm going to pull up some stats on the shotgun and, um, you know, I'll, I'll compare it to stats of other shotguns just so you can see the comparison between those. Um, because the chimney sweeper was definitely a way bigger pullout of, uh, you know, of guns than, um, the, you know, Santa's Little Helper. So, I'm gonna be right back. Give me one second. Okay, so, um, besides me being a broke little bitch, um, cause 3651 is all I have to my name, cause I just died with $400,000 on me, <laughs> and, uh, I don't carry around lockboxes and shit, um, which I'm, I'm not too upset about. I mean, I have zero dollars in my bank account, and I only have thirty six fifty one on me. But it's all good. It's all good. I don't, I don't care. Um, I'm extremely disappointed uh, with this weapon, and um, I'm gonna tell you why. Like I said, the Hammerhead forty seven, which isn't that expensive, um, as far as I'm concerned. I don't know how much they are nowadays. Um, I'm gonna go ahead and check real quick. Okay, no, they're 160 grand, and I mean, 14 millimeter is a little, is a little pricey. Uh, well, right now it's not. Apparently, there's only 12 grand, so that's really not that much for fucking almost 800 bullets. What's 0.55 at? I, I don't know if that's higher. Yeah, it's higher, 18,000. Uh, so, I, I mean, I understand that the uh, hammerhead doesn't shoot as fast, but it does do more damage per second and per hit. Um, than this gun does, and, um, as, in terms of the, uh, in terms of the chimney sweeper, which just completely revolutionized the fucking game, man, I mean, everybody's fucking using it, uh, uh, apart from the insane knockback that it has, um, just some stats for you real quick, the Buck Blast 99, which in the shop, I don't, I keep going the fucking back and forth. In the shop, the Buck Blast 99A, it costs... 75 million dollars. 75 million. The Chimney Sweeper? If I could spell chimney. 27 million. 27 million. Now, here are the stats for the top three shotguns in the game. Coming in in third place is the Buck Blast 99A, and that is going to take 10 gauge. It has a 36 round capacity, has slow reload speed, fast attack speed, and average accuracy. Um, and I believe for all of these guns, you're going to need 80 strength at least, and 120, um, 120 shotgun skill except the second one that one you only you need a little bit less um, but it does 220 damage per second it does 6.75 times 12 uh, damage per hit so that comes out to about 81 and the hits per second is 2.727 
Um, the con that is just above that is the X Manberg, which needs to be crafted, which is a little bit harder to get because you have to kill the Devil Hound in the um, in the you know the regular looting area, so that way you can get the uh, the heart, the Devil Heart, or whatever they call it. I really don't pay attention to that because I don't care. Um, it takes 12 gauge ammo, which is, I believe it might be slightly uh, less expensive than 10 gauge. Let's just check it out real quick. So 10 gauge for 726 is about 16,000, and 12 gauge. Yeah, okay. So for uh, $3,000, you can get 1,200, right now at least, you can get 1,200 uh, 12 gauge ammo. So um, it's a little less expensive than 10 gauge, but it does, uh, it has slow reload speed. It has a slow attack speed, and it has average accuracy. All of these shotguns will have zero critical chance. Um, it does 234.72 damage per second on average. Um, the damage per hit is 18.25 times 9, which is about 164.25. And the hits per second is 1.429. Um, and it, the crafting cost of that is uh, $3 million. Now... Um, the chimney sweeper which is or while well, coming in second place would be the x manberg and the chimney sweeper comes in first place um it takes 10 gauge ammo it has a 36 round capacity it has a slow reload speed an average attack speed and average accuracy um and it does 274.69 damage per second that is going to be 7.33, or damage per hit is going to be 7.33 times 20, which comes out to about 146.5, and hits per second is 1.875. Not to mention the disgusting fucking knockback that it has. And this gun, uh, the Chimney Sweeper, um... Like I said, it's not even better than the Hammerhead. Um, it, I just, I, 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 I can't see why you would want to use this over something like the Hammerhead. The ammo is more expensive. Um, well, at least as in terms of like right now, you still need 120 machine gun fucking skill. It, I, honestly, I am extremely disappointed. Not, I'm not disappointed that I died. Um, let's let's just get that all you know that that stigma out of the way. I'm not disappointed that I died. You know I've died using the chimney sweeper. That's just because I'm fucking around, and overall I'm just a shit player. Um, but it it's just not good, guys. I'm sorry. I you know if anybody's watched this far, and you like using the chimney sweeper, I'm sorry, but it's just not great. It really it really isn't. Um, there's plenty of other guns that you can use that are 10 times fucking better, you know, like the Scar 9000 or the Chimney Sweeper. Um, even the Hammerhead is better. So, I'm disappointed. Um, if you've made it this far into the video, uh, thank you for watching this far. Um, I want you to put Toasty Titties in the comments. That is Toasty Titties um, in the comments. I, I'm disappointed. I really am. I thought that this gun would be uh, slightly better when I was looking up the stats for it. I was like, yeah, I'll give it a shot You know just to see how it is, but it's um uh, It's really not not that great um, So while I sit here and bask in the four hundred thousand dollar loss that I just had um, I Will end the video. I hope you enjoyed um, If you did hit the like button the subscribe button hit the share button definitely leave a comment positive and negative It doesn't bother me. I just want to see some feedback and um, if you enjoyed that much and uh, you can't wait to see more videos that might come out, um, or if you like my opinion on the gun, maybe you have a, you know, maybe you share a similar opinion. Um, if you don't want to miss the videos that are going to come out, uh, or anything that I upload or do, um, be sure to definitely go down and turn on post notifications so we get notified every time I upload a video because you're not going to miss what is next. Gun's a fucking disappointment, you know. Um, thank you guys so much for watching.